Hello, Zebra Herd, and welcome back to LEGO City Undercover. And today, we're gonna to be continuing with our free play adventure throughout the overworld of the game. In the last episode, we got most of the important things done in Cherry Tree Hill. The only thing we're missing are uh, five secret characters that I figure, you know, I'm just getting a little exhausted on Cherry Tree Hills. Maybe we could explore it more later, but I've gotten literally everything else. So now we're gonna be moving on to a smaller area, so it should be a little bit more productive to explore. And if we have any free time, we could poke around more on Cherry Tree Hills. That is Heritage Bridge. We actually accidentally only unlocked one character from it, and that was Frank Honey. What we did is we went up to this like little building here, as you can see, and we uh, built this, and that just unlocked Frank Honey. So that was pretty cool. Beyond that, though, it seems like we have another of other things to explore. If we take a look, we have four golden bricks, and then one red brick, and then zero vehicles, but two other secret characters to find. So uh, beyond all of that, though, we have a statue to make, an astronaut flag to place down a pig, uh, another one of those little obstacle courses, and that's it. So it's not a ton, but it might be tough to explore this area. So we're just gonna be poking around and see what we can end up finding out. First thing I, of course, see is uh, this thing right here. Now, I wouldn't recommend that people go ahead and explore on top of bridges like this. It's a very, very dangerous thing to do. But, uh, you know, the game wants us to do it, so I'm gonna do it. <laughs> so I, I think that for right now, we've, we've already poked our heads into this like little uh, cave down there. Uh, when we were trying to explore Cherry Tree Hill, so I'm not too worried about that one. But I do see a lot of places to climb. So it's just really good to be trying to be like systematic with it, trying to go from one thing to the other. For now, though, I do see that we can climb up this, so we might as well. Whoa, this is cool, whoa, whoa, whoa. And we get a rainbow brick out of that. Nothing crazy, nothing crazy, but that's fine. I do see like this stuff. It looks like there's a way to get over there. But I don't quite see that way. I just heard a car explode. That's dangerous. Oh, ooh, down here, okay. So with this one open, I can plop on down, and then there's a way back up if I needed it. Don't really need it right now. And uh, that's it. <laughs> well, that wasn't very exciting. Am I sure that's it? Did I miss any kind of like, that's it? Oh, wait, no, yeah, that's it. Wow, that was uneventful. Weird, oh, oh okay, there's something over this way though. So what is this about? I can tear this down and we get another rainbow brick and then some, because I can go ahead and get the rainbow brick, which is mostly what this area has been so far. Come on, oh, I'm always so bad at this. Come on, jump, jump, good. And then from here, I can just climb up like that. And then what's gonna be up this thing? Maybe a whole bunch of nothing again? Oh, because advertisement for Papillardos and other things as well. Oh my, oh my, be careful. Didn't really have anything. That is so weird. I was like, oh, climb up here and find something. Oh yeah, but there's also nothing up here. Like, am I missing something? I don't know. Uh, and then there's nothing on this side either. What in the world? That is bizarre. <laughs> okay, I guess it's just sort of ways to escape if you accidentally fall down. That is so weird for sure. It was just really nothing. I don't think there was something I could do with all those signs. Why are there like eight different police officers on the bridge? I have no clue. I don't know if we can climb up on these little metal pipes. It doesn't sound like a very good idea, but uh, it's, oh, oh yeah, you just slide off. Okay, good to know, good to know. I don't think there's any way to get under the bridge or like it, it being a requirement or not. I'm sure that if we could get up on top of one of those parts, the really tall parts of the bridge though, that would certainly be helpful. No, I'm gonna drive Sorry. this car. Sorry, but uh, this car is almost slower than me walking. <laughs> uh, <laughs> I'm just trying to find a way up to these parts of the buildings. Cause we're almost done the bridge already. We've already run through. I have found like a bunch of nothing. So what's down this way? Probably more nothing. Uh, yeah, I'm not seeing much at all. Hmm, that is really bizarre. What is going on with this bridge? It is like, not much I can do. Okay, there's something here, that's good, that's good. All right, so let's just go ahead and hop up like that, and I get another, our millionth rainbow brick, but a teleport spot, that's really important. Where is this gonna bring me? Over to this side, where I get another rainbow brick. Uh-huh. Okay then. <laughs> I thought I was gonna get something different there, to be honest with you, and I didn't. I got the same old, same old. I mean, I have tons of rainbow bricks, and we have 400,000 of them, which is great. 
but I need more than that. Oh, ooh, here we go, here we go. Maybe this is the turnaround we needed. Uh, We'll break it apart, and then I will break into it. And then finally, let's get up there. Uh, hmm. I don't know what this is gonna be, but hopefully it's something worthwhile. And we're going to the top, which is good, this is what I wanted. Get on, come on, get across, get across. Yeah, we're, I hope we don't have a fear of heights because that fear is going to be very realized in a moment once we get to the tippity top. And we don't usually get this high up. I mean, we get pretty high up, but this is really tall. Okay, so we're about to jump across from like one side of the pillar to the next. Oh my gosh, all kinds of dangerous. Okay, come on, get up like that. Luckily we can go across these kind of pipes a little bit quicker. There's not really too much like jetpack stuff I can do around here that could like really, you know, cheat it out in one way or another. It's just sort of trying to survive. Oh gosh, I almost just ruined all of it. Okay, we're at the top, we did it. Hey, there's a pig, very good. I'll keep you in mind in a moment. I don't wanna have to take the pig off the bridge just yet if I don't have to. Um. Oh, okay, so I don't wanna pick that up just yet either because last time I did that, it launched me somewhere and I had to go all the way back up. So for now, for now, let's go ahead and get that pig. This is cool when we jump across these. Hi, Mr. Pig, we're riding this way, wee haw Giddy up, little piggy. So he can like jump across these all finesse-like as well. Oh, we got that. Is that a good thing? Will that bring me back with a pig? See, we basically have to do that entire free run again, but hey, that's fine. That'll be fine, it's at least something done, right? Um, and then, yay, we stay up here. So, I'm gonna go ahead and put you in if I can. Yeah. So I gotta change to the farmer to actually launch you, but you're the only pig in the area, so once I get this done, you'll be good. So see ya, Mr. Pig. I hope you enjoy the farm. Okay, so. Let us, okay, he's dancing still. Pigs return, three out of 22. We got lots more pigs to get back. And there's another golden brick for us. So I'm gonna, whoa, am I? Which one am I doing? Whoa, 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 I'm getting dizzy, hold on, don't do this. Whoa. And there's another rainbow brick. So we'll go back and do that free run in a moment. I figure we'll do other things to keep this fresh and interesting first. Uh, was that a red brick or a rainbow brick? I think that was a red brick. Oh, hey, look at that, it was a red brick. So what was that extra then? That could have been anything. Uh, maybe it was just ringtone, but maybe there's other things I can check out. Uh, track studs, collect sat-nav studs. Oh! So that was our new one for sure, that was definitely not there before. What that means is that if I were to set up that, like a little thing like that, sometimes, I guess it doesn't really matter too much because I guess it doesn't really make it for these kind of sat-navs. But um, sometimes, like especially during the uh, story mode, it'll be like, oh good, this way, and it'll have like a trail of studs for you to follow. You can't actually collect them, but I guess with this, you can, so that's very cool. All right, let's explode these, because yep, I can tell that we can build with them. Okay, get on up. So this one has, I think, yep, another uh, building, or not, oh, I destroy this one. We destroy the, uh, the image, the image, the statue of Rex Fury because he's a jerk. Yeah, so there's that done. Silver statue's destroyed, two out of 17. And uh, we get a gold brick for that one. So we're still looking for, how many secret characters? I think just one more, no, two more. Where in the world are those? Okay, well we're jumping off. And I haven't been up this one, but that's cool to go that we got another red brick. Uh, Just another rainbow brick. Okay, that is really eliminating my places to find secret characters, that's for sure. But we haven't been down this way. I don't know how far we can, oh, whoa. Well, where are we now? Whoa, that's quite a quick travel right there. I didn't know you could do that. Uh, we're gonna go ahead and uh, try to do that. And then I guess turn around and leave, but hey, now I know of a little bit of a shortcut. I didn't know you could just walk through the bridge. Awesome stuff. So, uh, one last thing I have to do is just go out to the front of the bridge from here. I don't really think we're gonna find much because it ends like right over here. But maybe I could poke around a little bit, look off the edge. I mean, I don't think going under the bridge, like I said, counts for anything, but maybe I'm wrong. Like, this is the edge of it for sure. Like if we go over this way, we are now technically in Festival Square, which is great and everything, but not where I wanna be. 
So yeah, but beyond doing the uh, super speedy stuff for the uh, free run, I don't know what I'm up to. That's sort of tricky, but at the same time, we found nearly everything else, so. Uh, yeah, like, what, what other things do I have to do? I need to find two characters, two golden bricks, we're gonna find one of those when the free run. Um, and then the little astronaut flag, where is that? I'd imagine maybe it's on the top of the other one, but how would I do that? Maybe if we do the free run, run we can unlock business. something. All right, police business, excuse me, sir. I gotta go this way. So I, I see the free run, should be quite easy to get there. Oh, that guy just ran right into the wall. Sort of feel bad. Um, yeah. Let us uh, start off, wait, wait, whoa, whoa, whoa. Yeah, okay, so complete the free run course before the time runs out, collect clocks for extra time. I am glad to. I see some extra clocks there in the little previews. So going up like this, go, go, go. All right, got clock one out of seven. So there's seven clocks again. I'll keep that in mind. These are always super fun and intense and stuff because we got another one and we got 40 seconds to continue forward. So keep moving, keep moving, keep moving and then go around the corner. Uh. And then plop on down. That's three out of seven. Almost, almost halfway there. We need a half a clock to be halfway there. Okay, so there's not really too much I can say about this. It's just climbing up the same bridge again. I don't really know how to feel about that. I mean, I sort of get the idea like, hey, uh, you know, you go through it one time to sort of figure out what you're supposed to do, and then you go through it another time with there actually being time, that way you sort of, uh, you know what to do. <laughs> Uh, and you're prepared for it instead of just being thrown against the clock when you don't even know which way you're going. But at the same time, I'm like, uh, I would just prefer if it was just one time and done. So, let's go ahead and grab that. And then finally, we got one more somewhere, I guess down here. So I guess that's sort of how we're supposed to get, whoa, 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 I don't know why I keep jumping, that's making it worse. Boom, last clock, and then we're at the end of it. Come on, keep going, Chase, keep going. And boom. Awesome, so there is that one done, and we can teleport it back here. Free runs, two out of 19 completed, and we should hopefully get a, a character uh, that is the skier, and then a golden brick. So I feel like I need to find a way to get on top of this other one. I do sort of see something, you see that? A little line across the uh, opening here? Maybe there's like some scaffolding I can this go across. I don't know. I'm gonna drive over there and try to find out, get a better look. Maybe I did miss out on something this way. It looks like it. it. Looks like there was more here than what met my eye. Oh, oh no, no! Ah, oh, this happens way too often. Okay, so I'm finally back. Luckily I didn't miss out on any like, like my my save or anything didn't mess up. So yeah, like it's sort of weird. It's up there, I guess it really isn't much, but I did see more this way. I just, oh, okay. Well, I sort of shortcutted my way here. <laughs> uh, you know, I really couldn't care less. I just want to be able to get to where I'm supposed to be, which apparently is up this way. Um, yeah, there, there's more this way. I don't know how you're supposed to normally get this way, but if this way works, I'm certainly not complaining. Wee! whoa. But it's basically the, sort of the same thing flipped. I just don't know how you would have normally gotten here except for doing the astronaut jump of faith, which I, I maybe that's what you were supposed to do. That'd just be a weird choice. Okay, got it. We're doing pretty good so far. Uh, whoa, I gotta be a little bit more careful maybe. Oh, and here's the secret character. That is the third one, and that is Ted Baxter. Whoever that is, we now have him. And then finally, there should be one last thing we have to do in this area, and then we'll be all finished up, and then I can reapply a bunch of my stuff. As you can see, it is putting the astronaut flag down at the very tippity top of the bridge. Awesome stuff. So, district's conquered, two out of 20. So if we take a look now, um, we're at 111 golden bricks out of 450, and beyond that, we have three out of three characters, zero out of zero vehicles, one out of one red bricks, five out of five golden bricks, and then everything else is completed. So that is some awesome, awesome stuff. Now I did say in the last episode that in this episode I would go ahead and purchase some extra character costumes that I haven't done in a while, so we're gonna go ahead and get started with that. Oh, and we got another rainbow brick. Very cool stuff. Can I grab one of those vehicles, please? Anybody else? Yep, thank you, thank you. Got the schmoozer. Okay, so yeah, we're gonna go to a character customization booth and see if we can't buy some new stuff. I feel like that'd be nice and fun. And then beyond that, uh, we'll try to maybe poke around more in Cherry Tree Hills. I feel like that'd be fine. Uh, oh, we went past it. Okay, make a U-turn. Make a U-turn. 
and it's right there. Okay. We <laughs> watch out for the car. So yeah, let's see, well, first off, we'll buy whatever characters we have available to purchase. I'll go ahead and purchase. So like here we have Frank Honey, we just unlocked him. And I could just play as Frank for the rest of today. Uh, just because that's funny. Um, over Rex Fury, we don't have too many other options, it seems. We have them all purchased, except for Grubby Grubster. And that's it. So yeah, I think that Rex Fury is the only one that has, like if I select that, like the person with the star is the one I have equipped. I don't know if anybody else has like the strength powers. I'm just gonna keep with Rex Fury. When it comes to the miners, um, we really only have Chase McKean or Chase McKean, like they're, they're, it's just a different color. Um, the astronauts, we have a number of people. I'm gonna go ahead and do, um, let's do this coloration of Chase McKean, seems pretty cool. But if there's any other I can purchase, that'd be great, doesn't look like it. And of course we can have customs. I'm not really interested at the moment. Uh, we have Troublemaker Phil, I guess he's a farmer. Uh, we'll go ahead and do, that Chase McKean farmer. Was there any other farmer? No, there aren't many farmers to choose from. We also have a number of firemen that we all have unlocked already. And then we got the engineers, the construction workers. We'll change it to that one. And then finally, the normal Chase McKean chooser. This is where a lot of our unlockables come from. Like we have residents. Uh, this is like where we currently have it chosen from, but there is also like Dave something and Street Racer and uh, Luis, Andrew, that seems to be it. So I could go all the way back, instead of being uh, this chase, it could be this chase with the puffy vest. Okay, that sounds great. But we're not quite, no, I said we're not quite done. <laughs> I'm not done, get back in that booth. Because there's other like people that we, we don't have equipped, but we got the demolition tummy, which is really funny. Uh, the skier, which we just unlocked, not too long ago. We have the rapper, which we also unlocked in the last episode. Look at him. The baseball player. That's pretty cool. Uh, special two. We have the ice skater. The detective. <laughs> Sherlock Holmes. Uh, Sleepyhead. Because he's just in his pajamas. And then we also have service people. So people like the taxi driver. And the train driver, Bill. And... Uh, the anchor man for 3,000. Like, these guys really aren't that expensive. The uh, TV reporter, looks like that's it there. And then some residents, yeah, we already saw that. So yeah, there we go. Now every character that we've unlocked so far, we have purchased, which is very, very awesome. Only thing I'm gonna do now is uh, turn everything back on that needs to be on. So yeah, basically all of this can be turned back on and it's just fine. Got it, got it, and then got it. Okay. Cool stuff, we are good to keep on going. I just have to figure out where may we be able to find more secret characters. Okay, well, I just wanted to see like some of the tops of these buildings to see if uh, they have anything. Like this super tall one does not seem to have anything. So I just wanted to go to the super tall ones and see like, am I missing anything up these ones? Because I, I really have been looking and I have not found a way up here normally. And it really looks like to me there's no proper way up here. There's like nothing up here to get regardless, even if there was a proper way up here. So I don't think I should worry about it. Beyond that, uh, I could check like the backsides of them. I don't think they really have anything though. Really doesn't look like it. Okay, well it's good to know, because that means it's one last thing I have to traverse. At this point, I am really thinking that maybe I'll just go ahead and uh, explore the next area, which is over this way anyways. So while I'm heading over there, I might as well take a look to see if I can uh, figure anything else out. I'd really like to be able to get all the characters before I move on to the new area. That just makes sense to me. I'm sure it makes sense to you too. Hmm. But yeah, I really don't see much. Like we've explored some of this stuff so gosh darn much. I really don't see what more I could do in most of them. Uh. I'm just trying to fly through real quick and see if there really is anything I might have like quickly missed. But I don't really see anything. We have been up here and we have done this little bird thing. There was another rainbow brick. I don't really care much about that. So I think that we are just about done with that and we'll spend the rest of today's episode exploring the new area, Auburn, which seems to be like sort of a bit of a dock area, which is pretty cool. So yeah, we're gonna go ahead and get started with this. It's gonna have a ton of stuff in it. I'm sure about that. Uh, so we're just gonna land like Sorry, that and business. steal this car apparently. That is so bizarre, but that happens like almost every single time. See, so, yeah, there's tons of stuff to explore in this area. As we can see, we have 25 golden bricks to get, one red brick, seven secret vehicles, and 20 secret characters, and a ton of that stuff. 
along the way. So uh, first off, we might as well try to reveal a couple of things. This is where we got our first character booth, as you can see. Um, I'm gonna back up to the like very beginning section of the area, though. That way, hopefully, I can explore this one a little bit more organized, and maybe that'll help me uh, find everything in order, because I feel like that was a problem I had last time. Maybe we should start on the beach. That'd be fun. Uh, so yeah, we're gonna start on the beach, explode, and take out everything I can, sensically. Gotta be careful in the water. Apparently, there are sharks. That is sort of scary when you think about it. Uh, so yeah, we can, we can do this kind of stuff. We get some rainbow bricks out of it. Not really too important. Well, good to know that they're there. I mean, I don't think I'll ever need more than the 434,000 I have right now, but maybe I'm wrong. So I'll keep collecting them while I have the chance. What does this box have? Something. A uh, palm tree. One out of four. Okay, I gotta look for more buildable palm trees. Like in this, probably this box right here. Or maybe just more buildable beach related things. Two out of four, that looks like it. Oh look, barbecue. I can go ahead and extinguish these flames. And that is uh, BBQ fire is extinguished. Another one done. Is there anything, ooh, I see this. Uh, so I can go ahead and explode. This gets me another rainbow brick. Sure, why not? But yeah, th this is actually turning out pretty well here in Auburn. Maybe we'll be able to make good progress here compared to Cherry Tree Hill. I mean, we always make, oh my. Oh my, I'm scared, I don't wanna swim in the water. Uh, we always make good progress at the beginning and then slow down later. That sort of just seems to be how it works. Here's an easy rainbow brick. All those seagulls are running away. What is this? There's a wheel. Weird. Uh, and then as the gardener, we can do something to get another rainbow brick because they're just everywhere, aren't they? Uh, yeah, I'm not gonna, like, I'm gonna have to like scroll through the characters a little bit more often to keep track of everything. So we'll go ahead and get this one. How many do we have in total now? We have 440,000. Okay. So what kind of buildable stuff do we got? There's another box. I don't think any of the non-box things really matter too much unless it looks like it's, you know, particularly for something. What was that? Oh, it's a jetpack thing. So we'll try that out in a moment. I wanted to beat up this, because this looks like a container of things, you know, that I could build like that. Three out of four, I was correct. So whenever it's like a container, that's always important to check out as well. What is this about? Oh, it's a little like a bucket of fish. <laughs> Interesting. I don't think it'll help me too much to break all this, but be free, fishies and crabs. You don't deserve to be sitting here for no reason. So yeah, let's go ahead and do this one where I need to jetpack. Uh, oh, that was it. That was sort of anticlimactic because I didn't really need that to do that. <laughs> okay, well, I got what I wanted, the rainbow stuff. And then here's one last one where of course I need the miner. Just like that, and he's gonna help me build one extra one. And with that, we can get our final rainbow brick that is on one of these poles. I don't even know what these poles are for. They're sort of chilling out in the water. But yeah, I should be able to break this stuff. Probably these barrels have the last thing we need to build, most likely, or not. Okay, so we're still looking for one more thing on the beach to build, which is odd, because I don't see it anywhere, but we also didn't go over yonder to this. Also, there's a barrel over this way, so there's a number of things I could still potentially get us something. Just wanna be much if there is anything. What about under these? No. Okay. Where's this last group of things I need to build? I mean, this is a cool shortcut. You could definitely take a jump off of here and make something. Ooh, here it is. So it's sort of more on the, 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 the uh, beach parking lot more than it is anything else. Unless that didn't have any, that didn't have anything in it. Okay, well, I'm still missing one of those. That's weird, where is it? We explored everything there from what I saw. So maybe I can check again in a moment. Uh, for now, I do see this. Is this anything? Oh, it's certainly something. A uh, whole bunch of nothing, that's what it is. Jeez, I hate it when it does that. When you think it's gonna be something, it's just nothing. I'll break every box like this I see, because one of them's bound to have something worthwhile. But in the meantime, there's clearly some things I can do this way with Rex Fury, you can break it open. Uh, we get a rainbow brick. Lots of rainbow bricks as a reward. Don't know how exciting that's supposed to be. If I had a yellow color gun, I could turn this bananas yellow. Okay, so I didn't need that. But I know that somewhere nearby, there'll be a way to explode something that's iron. I just don't know what that may be. Hmm, well probably up here, seeing how there is a way to get up this way. Whoa, camera didn't like that. Or maybe there isn't anything really up this way. So far it doesn't seem like much. Weird, there's just like, I don't know. Tons of stuff, but it's all a bunch of nothing. And I don't understand why. Come on, I just want free stuff. 
Where was there something explodable? Nowhere around this way for sure. Oh, maybe this way. I do see something that's glowing purple. It's another thing to break into. Oh, so there's a lot of these little crates we can break into, that's for sure. Uh, so this one has the color weapon. Okay, so that's very good. Can go ahead and do that. And then move back to this area and color up those bananas. Make right, those bananas nice and colorful. So I gotta get those two. Okay, I missed one. Uh, Come on, just get this one. <laughs> He's really adverse to that. Okay, so what did that do for us? That made us happy, yay! Uh, and it also got us a secret character. Very, very cool, who is that? That is Samson Crow. He likes bananas, I imagine. Okay, well there's that done. Is this where we put it? No, that's just sort of a thing that holds a rope. See, I have no clue where we're going to explode something. It could be on that side as well. Like, we have tons of places we can explore. So we just have to have a little patience, and we'll eventually figure it out. There's some stuff up this way. I'm gonna keep it on the beach, on the docks for now. I feel like that's just sort of, once again, a good way to sort of figure it all out. Uh, so yeah, let's go down this boardwalk. Or I do see a boat. I wonder if we, can we take the boats? That'd be pretty cool. Break this box, doesn't have anything, but it's good to check. Oh, ooh, what is this? You've discovered a hidden vehicle time trial challenge. I'll gladly take this. I accepted it before I got to read it, whoops. Okay, three, two, one, and drive. Oh, it looks like we can color those buoys as well. I don't know what's happening here. I'm pressing the drive button. I guess this boat takes a little bit while, a little while to rev up. Okay, so I gotta go through all the checkpoints. Oh my, oh my, it's a little bit scary to weave in like that. Okay, gotta do it again. Gotta be ready, gotta be ready, ready. Got it. And then where is this one gonna go? Between that, oh gosh, that's scary. We have to turn the buoys into red, I think. So I need to find out where to get a red color gun. I still don't know where to do that, because I was looking for that in Cherry Tree Hills as well. Boom, got it. And then come on, come on, come on. Got it. And then finally, well, probably not finally. There might be a lot more to go. Oh, here's the final one. So that was pretty simple, and it was nice enough to loop us around, which is good. Okay, awesome stuff. So there's another time trial done, which should probably unlock us that boat. Time trial is completed two out of 16. Very cool, and we also unlock the brawn, so a completely different one. Oh, look at this boat. That's cool. Uh, not much to do with it, so I'm gonna leave it where it is. Whoa, <laughs> we jumped off of that really high. Is there anything on this side? Uh, not really. Sometimes it can be pretty clear what you're supposed to break and what you're not, and sometimes it's just totally not. You know, like, okay, what in the world do I do here? Oh, hey, look at that little jet ski. Oh, that's cool. I wanna get that really quickly. I just wanna swim on it, or, or swim over to it. Whoa, this thing moves quick, ow. Ow, that hurt. I'm pretty sure you need to have proper training to drive one of these. Whoa, whoa, be careful. I just wanna get onto the ladder and get out of here. Just like that, awesome. So yeah, before, what color did we have? I guess right now we have yellow. We can only turn it back to yellow? That's sort of weird. Don't I have some kind of color gun specific thing? Like unlimited dynamite, super astro crate, super break and enter. I guess not, super safe crack. I don't know what that's supposed to mean. Okay, so maybe eventually we could get like a color gun red brick that makes it so no matter what, we always have the right one. That'd make it so easy, I love that. I love it when it's easier and more accessible. Oh, you know what, that's what the, when we crack open the safe, that's what that means, super safe crack. I get it. Anyways, that's the red color gun, so we can actually run back over here and detail the little buoys. I'm pretty sure that's what they're called. Uh, can we shoot that from here? Look at our wonderful aim. So that's boom, one out of five. So we might as well run back along the beach and see what else we can find because I'm still looking for that one fourth for something building there. And maybe it was just on the very far end where we started, I just missed it. Didn't know what I was looking for just yet. Cause I didn't see anything else I could really feasibly break up. Did I land my shot on that? I did not. Oh, that time I did. Cause I really don't see anything else. So it must be on that far end or like hidden behind a corner. I just didn't notice. Something like that. Boom. Okay, did that work? Whenever I look away from the shot, it doesn't work. So just keep it on on screen. <laughs> okay, uh, yeah, so I'm gonna do with the sunflower. No, it doesn't. But it could have. That's why I beat it up. Anyways, let's get back this way because I'm still looking for more of the buoys. 
But yeah, I really don't see what else I could like punch or kick here that would get me something. Oh, oh yeah, okay, I did miss one. They sort of blend in with all the buildings sometimes, depending on the angle. And, got it. Okay, so this is the last one, right here. And that gets me, five out of five, and something. Happiness. <laughs> Happiness for a deed done correctly and some kind of uh, rough looking guy. Maybe a sailor of some sort. So I'll have to go and get that in just a second. Beyond that, I do see like this rock I can beat up. But that's him. So where's this last one that they want me to find? Maybe it's on like the cliff edge here? That doesn't seem feasible. I didn't really properly go up this. Oh gosh, <laughs> I'm not going properly up it now either. But just a staircase to the boardwalk. Maybe it was like before even the beach began, but that also be just like a weird choice. Almost all of them have been in some kind of container. So I don't think that would stop now. There's so much like little bugs and birds and rabbits and stuff everywhere, it's, it's adorable. Whoa, you, you have to slide down this, whoa, whoa, whoa. Can I get up like this? Oh no, I can't. So it's definitely not up there. Then I don't know, it's a mystery to me, that's for sure. I mean, maybe it's like something to do with the grill, but that wouldn't make any sense because, I mean, I could probably destroy the grill. No, I can't actually. <laughs> oh, is it this? This the whole time? Oh, it's gonna be a sand castle. Wow, that was sneaky. Four out of four, that's why you destroy everything everywhere. Okay, whoa, there's, is that the character I just unlocked? Yeah, I could already see him in the background. Okay, so there's another secret character, so there's two down, and many more to go. So boom, got it, that is Garage Worker. No gold brick for that though, it's okay. I mean, we got other things done. But now that I have the red color gun, I'm tempted to go back to Cherry Tree Hill. Do I still have it? Uh, I do. Okay, so I might actually run back to Cherry Tree Hill and use it there, because there definitely is a place I can get a secret character. Uh, and we get Hot Tub McCready. Interesting name there, Hot Tub. Not really a common one, to be honest with you. Not many people are named Hot Tub. But hey, if you enjoy the name, that's the most important thing, so I hope you do. So, there's nothing much on this street. That's okay, because I'm just trying to find a, uh, a vehicle. It looks like there's another place to get TNT, for whatever reason. I mean, I'm sure I'll find a reason plenty enough, but I don't really even need it. It's just usually where whenever there's one of those around, that means it's somewhere we can find something that's worth exploding with TNT. But I have infinite TNT, so we just have to find the spot. But yeah, I'm gonna drive all the way back to uh, the one building with the revolving door. So I think if I take my corner down here, whoa, whoa, okay. And then jump off from this edge. Okay, that didn't work out too well. That's okay, I'm still moving. I'm still grooving, ah, oh gosh. And then, okay, maybe I went a little too far. <laughs> I went one block over again, I always make that mistake. Okay, so, it should be right here. Don't drive our car into it. Okay, we drove our car into it. But now with my red color gun, which I still have, it didn't like clear it. That'd be awful, I'd be so upset. Let's see what happens here. It has to be something. Whenever there's the actual color gun symbol, yep, just like that, it means something. And there we go, we did it, two out of two. So that should unlock a character, I'm almost positive. What else would it unlock? Except for some good feel good moments. Ah, and that's what that is for. Mystery solved. Okay, so maybe I could just jetpack up there? Maybe I don't have to worry exactly about doing it the legitimate way, because that'd be a pain in the booty. Can I hop off the fire hydrant? You bet I can. You bet I can. Yeah, doing things the easy way. Got it. So that is George Fartarbenspurry. Okay. Uh, so there's one less secret character to worry about there. Four in total remaining, and then we also got a good couple of things here. I'm probably gonna go back, though, to uh, the dock, the whole uh, area, because I feel like that was just more fun. To be honest with you, I enjoyed it. That was all the color gun related things I've found so far, though. So I don't really know uh, too much more what could be happening around Cherry Tree Hills. But it's for another day, so I'm not too worried. So we're gonna go back to the docks and focus all of our energy there. Because it's just good to do it in some kind of order, I believe. So yeah, back down this way, this is where we came from. Whoa, be careful, Chase, be careful. Try to pick up whatever studs I can along the way, just because it's nice to have them, right? I mean, I guess I don't need four billion studs, 
but it can't hurt to have, now can it? So we went down the one dock, and we found a lot of stuff by doing that. We found the good boat chase, we found uh, a jet ski, we found out that there's buoys to hit up with the red color gun. Now we can go down this one and maybe find equally as much. That'd be fantastic. These keep, you know, showing up. I keep on thinking they'll have something interesting, but they never do. But yeah, I think that maybe it'd just be smarter just to have Chase out as a space guy, hitting everything with the blaster as we just walk around. So it looks like there's something up this, and what this giant thing is, is I think this is basically a giant crane that picks up all of the freight crates that you find, or that, you know, I guess you uh see gigantic ships drop off. I mean, it doesn't look like it's currently operated, and that's a good thing, because we're on it right now. But uh, we can go inside. Yeah, look, this is where you operate it. Oh, that's so cool. We can't go inside, unfortunately. This would be a cool vehicle to try out. Uh, but we can climb up it. So let's do that. Da, 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 da. Looks like there is a character at the top. That's awesome. So all I want is progression, and we've gotten some of it. It is the Doc's Crane Driver. Well, you have a cool job, sir. I hope you know. See, that actually seems like it's everything on this strip of the boardwalk. Let's pick up some studs on our way back and destroy this thing. It has nothing, but it could have had something. Hmm. So I'll explore like the main road here afterwards. I feel like it's good to go down the dock strips first, though. So a lot of this I doubt is gonna have much, but I know we've explored this part a little bit to some extent. Oh, oh, here we go. But we've explored some of this part to some extent because of the story mode. Had us go over to this area a couple of times. But this time, boom, we explode that and we just get a rainbow brick out of it. Okay, nothing too exciting, but worth doing. Okay, well, uh, oh, there's this one. I know I said I wouldn't go over here, but I'm already over here. <laughs> I break all my own rules. I mean, I guess if there's any kind of rule break, it'd be your own. But only if it's to your own benefit. Oh, that guy's just waving at me, breaking into things. And that makes you an accomplice. You might not want to do that. I want to keep walking. So it doesn't look like there's too much over this way. It's just sort of a shortcut over to the other side. That's been, ooh. What can I do here? Is this a vehicle drop off station? Call in point, 8,000. We have plenty more than that. Yeah, so it's a yeah, vehicle super build. Like, you know, call on point, which is awesome. And you have unlocked the dragger. Awesome. That's some more stuff done. 113, 114 golden bricks. So I'm already working on getting all of the stuff I just spent back, all of the uh, super bricks are breaking stuff around here. And then here's just another secret character chilling out in here. This is uh, Clown Robber Max. Very cool. What's inside this building? Something that seems like I need the mechanics help with? Oh, maybe I think this is a part of the story mode. So there might be stuff in here that we've already done, so that's why it's confusing, but that's okay. We still might be able to find other things that are worthwhile, like this uh, astronaut jetpacking situation where we're getting across and, uh, ah, oh boy, no, no wait, no wait, come on, this isn't fair, this isn't fair, ah! <laughs> oh, come on, that's silly. Luckily, Chase can swim. So I need to, Get back on land. Apparently that's more difficult than it looks for Chase. Okay, we made it, don't worry. Oh, is this a maze? Oh, this is a maze. Oh, look at this. Oh, well, that's cool. I mean, what a surprise at the end. Uh, except for being very confusing. I mean, maybe I shouldn't try to skip out on it. <laughs> it doesn't look like there's anything in this maze. So that's a weird choice for a maze. Is a maze that doesn't have anything. Oh wait, right here. There you go. Oh, oh, I see. I did the wrong way. Now this is sort of like Pac-Man. <laughs> I don't know, pick up as many of these studs as I can. Uh, did I miss something this way? It looks like I did. Maybe if I get all of the studs that it created, which it looks like I did. Oh, three seconds. I gotta find the exit. I didn't even see the clock. Oh, well. Let's try that again. Oh, no, I did it. <laughs> Maybe I didn't do it and it just gave it to me anyways. It's a consolation prize. Come on, let me out of here. Maybe this just isn't the exit. That's weird. But okay, so go back around this way and get secret character number whatever. It is Tow Truck Diver. Nice. Oh yeah, so I guess there are a number of blocks uh, blocking me here. 
There wasn't anything behind that, doesn't look like it. That was cool, I like that. That was, that was a little bit of a thinking outside of the box. So we'll probably just about wrap that with today's episode. We might do a little bit more. Oh, here's the uh, pig drop off. I don't know when we're gonna find a pig, but now we know where to go, which is a good thing to know. I don't know if we've ever explored on the top of this building. Of course, we've now just looked into the garage and didn't find much for us now. But like I said, parts of this have been explored in the story mode, some of it has not, so I'm just trying to figure that out. I really don't need that super brick. I feel like it's mocking me now, but <laughs> that's okay. I have some humility. I don't know how much we actually explored this boat, though, so I definitely wanna go up here and check everything out. Maybe we could find some cool stuff. More than anything, I could get to this building now. So let's go for that. Whoa, okay. Oh, whoa, whoa, push me off. Oh, that's so rude. Oh, that's the worst. Okay, okay, whatever. Whatever, you don't want me up there that way. I get it. But it's a flat surface then. You shouldn't have made it a flat surface if you're just gonna push me off of it like it isn't. That's just silly. Maybe I could just get away, get over there from here. I can, okay. Well, leave it to me to do things the long way around. There's nothing up here anyways. Why'd I do that? Okay, so, well maybe we'll just stick to this part of the dock then. I mean, I try my best to explore it a way that maximizes our capabilities of finding as many, many things as possible. But still, sometimes it's easier said than done. And to see this rainbow break, that one's super easy to get. And then we can get these two boxes broken for no reason at all. I just don't like boxes, apparently. I don't know if we can get up to this crane. Like, it looks like maybe if we used a jetpack in the right way. Okay, there's nothing on top of there, so I can just go from here. I don't know, a lot of this looks unfamiliar to me, as if I had not explored it yet. Hmm. Well, I'm exploring it now. There's not too much on that side. But I can get up like this, get on the ladder, and uh, keep moving, keep moving. There has to be something awesome. There it is, that's something awesome. It is a secret character that is Sarah Horner. Cool. Oh, and is this I think is an area we explored. This is like a part of the story mode. There is really a whole bunch of nothing around here, which makes sense for the story mode just because uh, you're just trying to make it from basically point A to point B, progressing the plot. Yeah, I could make my way on the crane here. I just don't know if it's gonna get me anything, especially with this camera not really being helpful with the idea. Uh, I can't quite get on that platform. Okay, it's clear that I'm not supposed to. So that's everything for this trip. I'm almost positive. Because we just really explored that pretty thoroughly. I didn't find anything else. So I'm gonna poke around for an extra minute or two and then we'll be all wrapped up. Because I see a whole bunch of studs. But that doesn't help me too much. I mean, I got plenty of studs. <laughs> we already know that. We're about to hit four billion. <laughs> but yeah, the docks go on forever. It's like half of this area is just docks and like working stuff, the boring stuff, you know? I mean, it's not boring to explore in the game, but it would be in real life. <laughs> At least that's how I see it. Maybe other people would disagree. Okay, so yeah, this area seems like it, it has to have something, right? They wanna have just like a huge open empty area. That'd be weird. Okay, oh, there's another little jet ski thing. That's pretty cool. Don't think it helps me quite yet, but maybe there'll be something with it later. Hmm, does this bridge? Okay, yeah, the bridge itself here is also its own spot, so I don't wanna go too far that way. We're definitely gonna be spending a lot of area in the docks. We're gonna have like a lot of time to spend here in, what is it called, Auburn? Auburn's gonna take us forever, because it just seems like it's even bigger than Cherry Tree Hill. But that's why it's fun! So what is up on top of this building? Lots of stuff. Ooh, I see our hidden rock. Yeah, there it is, that's good, we'll get that. So, give that a good smashing, thrashing, all that kind of stuff. Boulders destroyed, two out of 22. So, 11 times more than what we've gotten. Well, I mean, anyway, two times 11 out of 22. But, uh, we need to do it 20 more times than what we currently have. Maybe that's a bad way to explain it. <laughs> Anyways, ooh, I would not, not have seen this if it wasn't for total luck. But hey, sometimes this is how it works. Oh, that was just nothing important. Okay, <laughs> I keep getting excited for something new and then it's not, it's something old. 
So I don't know what's in there. Huh. Maybe that's something we could possibly open up? I don't really see a way to though, so maybe it's just supposed to be gated off, but it doesn't look like it, right? Like these, this gate looks peculiar. Oh, what is this? Uh, apples, just in case you were hungry. <laughs> All right then, maybe that'll be where we wrap it up. We have explored a little bit of Auburn, we explored the bridge earlier, and actually got it fully completed. So that was a lot of awesome stuff in today's episode of Lego City Undercover. If you want to put a video, make sure you comment Jet Ski Zebra, so that you've watched at the end, that you are a zebra-tastic viewer. Check out our websites like this one on your screen right now, or by subscribing to join the zebra herd. Either way, thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you next time, bye-bye.